Unpaid internships may soon be a relic of the past, and the timing couldn't be better for college students who are struggling to find jobs. Yeah, tonight's Family 411. Sheila Gray shows us why it's not just college students who could benefit from a new trend in internships. College is expensive, and it's not just the college itself. There's the other things that come with it. It's um, being an engineer. It's the laptops. It's the programs. It's, there's so much more than just the college that you have to pay for. College freshman Andrew Hamilton is already thinking about how to offset those expenses and get real-world work experience. So he checked out this university career and internship fair. We view internships and co-op opportunities as a talent pipeline. Dave Ferguson's job is to line up that student talent for General Electric. The company offers about 2,000 paid internships and co-ops each year. We look at these folks as the next generation of leaders. The students should be compensated for the work that they do, and I, I've seen a rise in the number of employers who are compensating their interns. The U.S. Labor Department has a six-pronged test for employers to determine whether they should be paying. The major criteria, whether an employer gains advantage by having an intern. I think just having additional staff helps you be more successful and increase your productivity. About 62 percent of the college internships in America are paid. And while some students say that makes the company more attractive, others say it's all about the experience. They give in something to you, so you should be, you know, thankful for that. So these are unpaid internships. Um, because the students gain valuable experience. Government and nonprofits are exempt from the Labor Department test, but colleges and companies like GE think paying for that talent helps more than just this generation of students. It helps America. I like to say that the team with the best players wins. Well, the experts uh, predict that within a few years, all employers will be required to pay their interns. But unpaid internships will only exist if students are willing to take them. And for more information on our Family 411 reports, log on to our website, WLOS.com.